time. Feels like everywhere you turn around these days, it's pumpkin flavored this and pumpkin flavored that. You can get pumpkin spice latte at the coffee shop. You can get pumpkin bread and pumpkin muffins and pumpkin everything everywhere you turn around and go. Yeah, you can buy a can of pumpkin and use pumpkin puree, but you also can buy your own pumpkin and go from there. Hi, I'm Nika Waters and welcome to Tasty Thursday. Today I'm gonna to show you how to take a pumpkin that looks like this, turn it into puree, and then a yummy pumpkin muffin recipe. Three steps to dealing with a pumpkin. Chop off the top, scoop out the seeds, cut it up into chunks. So I'm going to take this, it's covered, and I'm going to put it in the microwave for probably six or seven minutes uh, and poke it and see if it's all done. So I've actually done this for a grand total of 10 minutes in the microwave and I'm poking it and it's nice and soft. So then what I want to do is I'm just going to scoop the stuff away from the peel. Once you have finished scooping all of the cooked pumpkin out of the peel, you put the top on your food processor and you process away. So there we go. I've got about a little over three cups of wonderful pumpkin puree from a little bit of work. Um, and I know what's in it. No extra anything. So once I've got all my pumpkin pureed, I actually want to freeze it. If you wanted two cup amounts, you could do two cup amounts. I'm doing a cup and a half uh, so that I can just pull it out whenever I want to make my pumpkin muffins and I've got it. No measuring required. So my kids love pumpkin muffins and they're pretty easy to throw together. I'll finish my workout, I'll make the muffins, I'll go upstairs, take a shower, and I have time to take a shower and get dressed and what have you and I come down and the house smells wonderful like pumpkins and it's a nice enticement for my guys to get out of bed in the morning. The first thing you wanna do, preheat the oven to 375. By the time it's preheated, your muffins will be ready to go in the oven. But I find this pretty easy. So there you go, how to make pumpkin puree out of fresh pumpkins, how to make delicious, amazing pumpkin muffins. Happy, happy, tasty Thursday. If you like what you've seen, press like, tag a friend you think should see it, share it, and don't forget to subscribe. These things just get better and better.